finding the configuration of a chiral methyl group, which is probably one of the more obscure things you'll ever run into in the field of chemistry. And what we're going to do is we're going to take the chiral methyl group that's attached to nitrogen. So this is a methyl group that's asymmetric or stereogenic, if you will, on the basis of the having three isotopes of hydrogen attached. So an H, a D, and a T. And we'll put two groups on nitrogen just to keep its valence happy. Okay? And the question is, is, is this an R or S methyl group? And so what do we do? We have to put the group of lowest priority behind in a Newman projection and then assign priority carbon looks like it's the hydrogen. So the hydrogen is going to be kind of lurking behind and if we were to kind of translate this in our minds we could put the nitrogen down low okay. it looks like the T is going to come up to the left and the D is going to come up to the right about as obscure as nitrogen has the highest priority Deuterium has a second priority. Whoops. Tritium has second priority. Tritium has, okay. And then we chase out from high to low. From high to low, we go, go, go. And we're chasing out a clockwise motion. So this group should be R. We double check things, and I think we've done it right. I think this is an R-methyl group. Thank you very much.